Like Vincent Noble Logistics News and Entertainment. The Stench Free Zone. Speed limiters are back in the news. I used to be against these. Staunchly against these. Still am. Only because I hate laws and I hate mandates. Those for or against speed limiters are arguing out of their asses. Independence and the enterprise truckers. You're both acting like a bunch of morons. There's no time savings in speedings whatsoever. There's studies all over the place that prove it. It isn't. Maybe a few minutes over 100 miles. Maybe. It's an aggression thing, period. It is not safer. It costs a lot more money. The only thing that is annoying is two dragonfly truckers going up a hill. One is going 0.1 miles per hour faster than the other one and can't pass the guy. So they're side by side up the hill. And then when they go down the hill, he starts to slow down. So everybody tries to get around him and then he goes back up the hill and then slows down again. That's the annoying part. Look at this. I got a ticket over the summer and I did this little thing because I used to speed like crazy. I swore. I, I, was, I hated driving. I just wanted to be there. Right. And I would say this openly. Right. I got a ticket and it was expensive. And I decided, you know what, I'm going to not speed because this is stupid. So I stopped speeding and it became a game. I was like, okay, let's try and notice some things. Here's what happened. I drove the speed limit every day and my stress of driving went away. I didn't lose any time. I wasn't saving any time. The old me that was passing me all day long and stuff like that, every day when I was driving, looked like an idiot down the road at a million miles an hour all stressed and oh, why don't you get out of my blah 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 look like idiots 106 drivers 65 mile an hour um uh road commute over a week oh over six weeks 25 seconds saved 25 seconds on average was saved